Have you ever wondered why we celebrate Veterans Day every November 11th? It's more than just a day marked on our calendars. It's a day of honor, a day of remembrance, a tribute to all those brave men and women who've served in the United States Armed Forces. From the trenches of World War I to the deserts of the Middle East, they've defended our liberties, shaping the world as we know it today. Join us as we journey through time and uncover the history of this important day of remembrance. Our journey begins in 1918, at the end of the First World War. As the world exhaled, the 11th hour of the 11th day of the 11th month marked a pivotal moment. The Armistice, a ceasefire agreement between the Allies and Germany. This was the birth of what we initially knew as Armistice Day, a beacon of hope and peace amidst the ashes of the Great War. In the United States the day was first observed on November 11, 1919, one year after the war ended. However it wasn't until nearly two decades later in 1938, that Armistice Day was officially recognized as a national holiday. It was a day of gratitude, a day of reflection, a day to honor those brave souls who had fought in the war to end all wars. But as the pages of history turned, Armistice Day began to take on a broader significance. It was a day to celebrate peace, but as history unfolded, the celebration evolved. The peace of the world was again disrupted with the onset of World War II and the Korean War. These conflicts saw millions of men and women serve bravely, adding to the ranks of American veterans. It was clear that the scope of Armistice Day needed to broaden, to honor not only the veterans of World War I, but all those who had fought valiantly for their country. In the mid-20th century, a pivotal change took place. A World War II veteran named Raymond Weeks proposed an expansion of Armistice Day to celebrate all veterans, not just those who had served in the First World War. His idea gained traction, and in 1954 under the leadership of President Dwight D. Eisenhower, a legislative change was enacted. Armistice Day was officially renamed Veterans Day. This was more than just a change of name, it was a shift in focus, a broadening of scope. It was an acknowledgement that every man and woman who had put on a uniform and served their country, deserved recognition. Veterans Day as we know it today, became a day to honor American veterans of all wars, a day to express our gratitude for their selfless service. This transformation reflected the ever-evolving nature of our society, our understanding of service and sacrifice, and our commitment to honoring those who have given so much in the name of freedom and democracy. From a day of peace to a day of honor, Veterans Day became a tribute to all who served. Today, Veterans Day is more than just a date on the calendar, it's a nationwide tapestry of gratitude woven from countless expressions of respect and recognition. Across the United States, the 11th of November resonates with the echoes of parades, the solemnity of ceremonies, and the hush of moments of silence. In towns both small and large, sidewalks brim with patriotic parades, a vibrant display of American spirit. Schools, offices and public buildings don the tricolor, and the star-spangled banner rings out, a poignant reminder of the bravery of those who have donned the uniform. Ceremonies held at war memorials, veteran hospitals, and military cemeteries are imbued with reverence. They serve as a touching tribute to the men and women who have served our nation a reflection of the sacrifices they have made. But amid the fanfare, there are also quieter acts of appreciation. The moments of silence observed at the 11th hour are powerful in their simplicity, a collective breath held in honor of those who have given so much. In every corner of the country, Veterans Day serves as a poignant reminder of the sacrifices made by American veterans. It's a day to pause, to reflect, and to express our deepest gratitude to those who have worn our nation's uniform, on Veterans Day, we remember, we honor, and we thank those who have served. Because freedom isn't free, and it's their sacrifice that has paid the price. As we reflect on the sacrifices made by our veterans, we are reminded that we too can play a part in honoring these brave men and women. It's more than just a day of remembrance, it's a call to action. We can show our gratitude by supporting local veteran organizations, contributing to their missions, and ensuring their efforts are recognized. Small acts of kindness can also make a significant impact. A simple thank you to a veteran in your life can mean more than words can express. We can also play a pivotal role in educating the younger generation about the importance and significance of Veterans Day. By sharing stories, experiences, and historical facts, we can keep the spirit of this day alive in the hearts of our children and grandchildren. Let's make every day a Veterans Day. Because honoring our heroes should not be confined to just one day. 
Together, we can ensure that the sacrifices of our veterans are never forgotten, and their service is forever honored.